Next up will be the men's 100 metres T13 victory ceremony. This from last night. Excellent race in the end, and Poland's brilliant success continues. They've got nine gold medals here. And this is the latest to add to the collection. Philip Handler and Mateusz Michalski have already had run-outs on track this morning. I'm sure they'll have gone and showered themselves up ready for their moment in the limelight for the 100 metres medal ceremony. And Switzerland with the bronze, Philip Handler, just as it was in Swansea two years ago. He's actually a silver medalist in the previous Europeans in Stadkanal in the Netherlands. Had bronze in the two there, but hasn't uh, doubled up with a double medal success since then. It could happen here. Been European champion in Swansea, but dethroned here. Radislav Zlatanov of Bulgaria. Silver for him all the same. Should see him in the long jump as well. He's generally very successful in that. Again, it was in Stad Canal, the only championships in which he's won more than one medal at an event. He doubled up in the 200 with a silver and a bronze and a one in. Uh, 2012. Back to the top step for Matthias Michalski of Poland, the double sprint champion over 100 and 200 from the World Championships in Christchurch in 2011 and Lyon two years later. A welcome return to glory. And I actually passed him just ahead of his uh, semi-final this morning. Really is well built. You can see where the power in the legs comes from. And for the ninth time, Poland have won a gold medal here this week. Only Russia have done better than that. Michalski, the European champion over 100 metres in the T13 classification.